Hello everyone, this is Harris Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Wolong Let's Play. So we have some new gear. In between episodes, I decided to grind out Zhao Yun's duel and pick up a full set of his gear. Four stars, and what we are doing with this set is that I modified everything for fire damage because the pre-built on it has a lot of flame fire attack and burn accumulation and whatnot. Uh, the bonuses for the full set has nothing to do with fire. But we have Deflect Spirit Consumption, which is something that we do quite a bit. Deflection is sort of my go-to playstyle. I don't really guard. Morale Rank, Point Gain, and Power Gain upon Deflection. More Deflection. Spear Damage Bonus. And the Spear itself, we changed it up a bit. There was a Spear I got with Flame Attack and Spear Vulnerability on Enemy upon Martial Arts. That one we placed on ourselves, and the Flame Enchant we placed on ourselves because... We had two of those um, halberds we were using that both had flame enchant, so we disenchanted one of those or we uh, salvaged one of those to pick that up, put it on the spear. Now the full set is sort of fire damage built. Put the bronze dual sword from fighting the flying swallow, Zhang Yan, uh, which also has a little bit of burn bonus that we've been using as a supplementary weapon. Uh, changed up a few things on the bow and the crossbow. Both has a little bit of luck. Uh, both have... A little bit of flame attack for us. The only two accessories we have with flame attack or burn related bonuses are these two here. Uh, the Liu Bo dice obviously gives us a bit more luck, which helps picking up better gear as we farm. Uh, the spells we have there are just for testing purposes. Uh, basically, they enchant your weapon with all sorts of different elements. We're not really going to use that. We're going to stick to the fire. Typically not going to be a wizard uh, in the game. There is that loot right there. I do wonder how we can pick it up here. We were a bit rushed entering this stage last time, so we didn't really get to explore the whole place. So we're going to take our time here as we look for the remaining four battle banners and five marking flags. We are going to backtrack a bit. I don't think there's anyone except for him. Now the damage on this build is pretty ridiculous. Although I still have to get used to the martial arts on this weapon, as well as the spears animation, which is a little bit different than what we've been used to. It does feel better than the halberd we were using for the other fire build, so hopefully an improvement. We kick down this tree to open up to the previous zone, which we can clear again, just to get a little bit more familiar with the weapon. I think we can kill him with the bow and him. And then we take care of the big monkey downstairs. That's our two martial art abilities. Nobody took care of him. We didn't get the loot upstairs. We can go back and get it from our two range kills. I don't think we can jump up here. We have to go back to here. This is the first character item set that we are ooh, we are using. It's not going to be the last. Unfortunately, didn't get the sneak, but you can see the fire accumulation on one hit. It's about a quarter to a third. And uh, we do massive damage here.
Need a little bit more practice with the proficiency of the spear. Does he move or is this just a free backstab? The only thing I'm complaining about the spear is the elements attribute attached to it. It's earth mainly, and our build is wood and water. There's a decent amount of water on it, but it's not the highest. The earth is A already. As you upgrade these, it's plus seven right now. The elements will go up. I think water goes up next time, uh, maybe to an A minus or a, a B plus on the plus eight. <laughs> Not that Earth is bad, it's just that I prefer the water element a bit more. It's still nice that the other two are its supplement, as in wood and water are the two supplement elements. So we cleared all that, we went back that way and we cleared all the way back. And we can proceed here into the mausoleum. <laughs> All right, lots of demons, no big deal. Mm, he saw us. We can kill this one without him noticing, right? He saw us. Uh, gotta jump those mushrooms. Are these not jumpable? Okay, maybe those are not actually what we're supposed to do. But they look like... Oh, from a certain angle. Interesting. I don't actually want to go down to take care of those guys. Maybe we can just snipe them from up here. Because that jump took us a while to clear. Ah, this guy is at a weird place. Oh, there's another guy. Alright, we'll have to jump back up to clear the roof, but let's collect what we got here. Any alternative way of jumping up? Nope. I think from the front? There we go. That house might have something in it, but let's check the roof first. Okay, nothing. It's a free chest. It's a foreign concept in this game. Nothing great. Our last shot. Still want to kill him. We have a bow. It's not the end of the world. Quite a few big guys. That's a spider. And that's a marking flag. Yep. 
We need to get above this house. Ooh. He's stuck. Yeah, he's stuck on the railing. He spotted us, but he can't come down. And we have trouble going up as well. Let's kill him first. Fire stacking is so easy now with the burn accumulation. Finally found our way up. We're gonna go down though. Two hits and he's gonna burn. Stun from that and then just death. We're gonna get our rank 10 with Liu Bei and Zhang Fei here. Pick up a set of their items. How about the other two houses? How do we... I thought there would be a way to get on the roof or something. Tree. Okay, from here. Anything on this roof? Nope. Are we supposed to clear that jump? What happened to that spider? I think we're supposed to clear that jump. Or wait till we get to that side. Oh, I see it. Never mind. It's right here. We saw a spider. Where did it go? Can't see it. That guy alive? No. Maybe Liu Bei and Zhang Fei got it as it jumped down somewhere. It's a possibility. Rank 8 leather, okay. That is useful. We haven't gotten any rank 8 gear yet. That looks like a suicidal jump. Uh, we're supposed to go through that bridge. <laughs> Feels like there's nothing here, though. Oh, shit, yeah, sure. Almost forgot you. <laughs> Another one rescued. Let's see if it's any good. I mean, currently we're only interested in fire abilities, but since those can't be embedded and altered, we'll keep every single one of them for future builds. We're going to need different things at different time. There's a chest in there. Okay, I see a warlock there. Say goodbye. There's a wolf right there, but I guess we kill the wolf first. I don't think we missed anything behind us. There's a guy right there. Okay, we're gonna get the high ground. Move to the other building first. Anything else we're dealing with here? 
Looks like just a big guy. Light him ablaze. Ah, one of these little boats to cross the lake in the future, or the river. There's a loot up there. Digging this set, the damage is very comfortable. How did we miss this loot? Because we've been on this side already. This is where we started, I think. Yes, this is where we started. We just didn't see it right in front of us. Oh! We come back with no health. A little drink up. There's still a loot up there. Oh, on the outside. Okay. We got the marking flag and was super happy. How do we get out of this little room, though? Huh. There's no doors. That's not it. There's another path up this building. That tree, this roof, goes from this roof. Okay, we start here. See that guy right there. Courtyard. Actually, a little shortcut. This place is the place where the Taizu I mean, Liu Bei is sort of trying to mimic the achievement of Liu Bang in his life, starting from very little. Oh, please don't fall. Oh, come on. I'm sure... Wait. We swim for a little bit before we uh, drop dead. Oh, this is... Uh, I think it's one... Yep, yeah, one jump. Don't, don't try to land there. It's just a little platform to get up. Uh, but there's nothing up here. It's rather disappointing. Uh, let me heal before someone just hits me with one little swing and kill us. We have a giant terracotta. Is that the boss here? I'm waiting for him to do his critical. Everything else is too slow. Oh, we can we can burn these guys? I guess we could just kill them. The critical animation is a little too slow. Ah, a Changui. Guarding a chest. Turn around, please. This is not his tomb, even though it's a mausoleum. I think he's not buried here. By any means, he has the Imperial Tomb. This is just the hometown shrine for the family to pray to. Which 
turn. Ah, uh, he moved just a little bit out of range. He wasn't targeting us. Made it a little bit easier. That thing is alive. That giant thing. He's the only thing in the courtyard? Oh, we missed the loot. We can try to backstab him. Assuming that we got this angle on him already. Does it ever turn red? Nope, it doesn't. Ooh. They're killing him. Uh, not that hard to kill. I mean, he smashed Obey. Ah, get ourselves the prayer room. Alright, so here you would put a light out. I mean, there usually should be these tablets with names on it and you put a light out or incense out for them but they have the main they have the main little tablet here that's for Gozu himself all right we're supposed to find an entrance to the there we go at least it's not sewers this time it's just a lot of terracottas not all of them will attack and I don't think we can sneak up on these guys. Maybe just the big one that we can't sneak up on? We'll test this out. Oh, that helps. We'll try to sneak. We have a four-star version of that, the brief explanation of Sun Tzu. It's um, Cao Cao's gear set, since Cao Cao wrote that. He wrote a commentary on the Art of War. Oh, we have humans now. Let me get the good stuff first. Tai Shan Champion. A bandit gear. Is that a full set, or is that just the name? It's just the name. Okay. We don't need it. It's gonna turn around. I'm not gonna get there in time. Oh, maybe not. Just in time. I mean, this is where the story becomes a little confusing with historical takes because Liu Bei would lose his family twice. Uh, the first time in Xia Pi, which is what sort of this version is, where Zhang Fei loses them. And that would be where Liu Bu returns them because Liu Bei essentially surrenders and becomes a subordinate. The second time was Liu Bei rebuilding in Xiaopei, which is where we are now. And he rebuilt his force a little bit too big, 10,000. 
and Ripu became very uncomfortable with that, knowing that he betrayed Nobe before, and it's likely Nobe will betray him in the future. So Ripu attacked Nobe outright, chasing Nobe's forces out of the Sioux province. And that's when Nobe lost his family for the second time, and that time it was basically Nobe's own fault, couldn't protect them. And Nobe ran off to the Imperial Court, controlled by Cao of course. Oh, where did he come from? Assassin, no wonder why we didn't see him. Maybe from the roof? Because I really didn't... Maybe either here or from the roof. Super scenic, We've got the autumn leaves falling. I don't know if I'll make it. Perfect. And Liu Bei would get his uh, family back again for the second time because Cao Cao gave Liu Bei a force and they came back to attack people together. Which also happened in couple phases. I think Sao Dun reinforced first, and uh, that didn't go well. Oh, I can't. I missed the shot. Controller's not the easiest thing. Let me wait till he turns. We got a lot of time to get him on the way back. He didn't drop any arrows for us. Okay, we can check the roof from here. Assassin's on the roof. Okay, so that confirms where that first one came from. There's none on the other side. Okay, we can jump down and get the marking flag. Is that the only thing here? Or oh, there's an inside? Alright, the door can't be opened here. Can we open the door here? Four guys. Okay. <laughs> And I guess we enter through front door? Because there's no gap on the roof to jump down from. Front door it is. Ah, uh, okay, we deflected that. Let me kill him first. John Faye's got him. Wasn't too hard. We have friends. How about this side? Does this open? No. I feel like we got everything. I think he dies, and we just fight the other one straight up. Our right, missing one of each. So if there's a bit more to this stage, which I hope there is, then we're not really missing anything.
Okay, that's the last banner. We're looking for the last marking. Uh, he should have some other friends. If he's the guy who's guarding the banner. Is it just him? Making sure we didn't miss anything. Okay, if it's just him, we have a way to backstab him. From the route we opened up. He had a friend. Okay. If the boss is upstairs, we are missing once again one marking flag. We'll check upstairs first. There should be some sort of door or Unique space that we can see. Yep, that's the boss. Hmm. Alright, only one marking. Usually worse than this, but always at least one marking. Gonna have to sort of backtrack to see where it could be. Wait, we haven't been here, have we? No, we have. We jumped in from this underground passageway. We got the chest here. Yep. So once we came out, there was one marking over there. I think we have to go underground again. We got this one. So it must be somewhere before we popped out from underground. Ah, we found it. Okay, that was quick. So I wonder who we shall fight here. Gao Shun, Zhang Liao, Chen Gong. It can't be Li Bu again, can it? Liang为主 Okay, he means business. Got all these lightning effect. Which means he's wood element and we are using fire, so we should have advantage here. Whoa, we blocked all of those. Hold on. That spin attack, I think we blocked like four hits. Kind of want to see what he does before you kill him. Yes. 
Yep, we deflected everything. All right, we turn off his lightning. Oh, he's getting it back. Ah, oh, should not be standing still and healing. Wow. Two can play this game. Now, historically, Zhang Liao was never in Xiaopei. He was given a chancellor position by Lü Bu, and the only reason why he didn't die at uh, Xiaopi when Lü Bu went down was because he wasn't at Xiaopi. And by the time he arrived as reinforcement, the battle was already over. Oh, another one. Back to back. Okay. Wow, that is hard to block. We're gonna just have to hit him. He's using his sword like a spear with the lightning. Oh, we're out of heals. Wow, he got us. Ooh. It was close. I think if we attacked him a bit more in the beginning rather than sit back and watch him. Um, I would like to get a little bit of a morale boost back. Some easy target to kill. Uh, starting with the guy on this side. If we get it back to about 22, we shouldn't have any problems. Is there someone down here? No. There is someone upstairs, though. We can test our theory if there's two assassins up here. Yep, there's two. You should get close enough. Oh, Archer. Alright, 22. I think we just kill this guy while we're here. Anyone to give us a nice even 23? Uh, room full of enemies. No thanks. We'll kill the one on this side. He should turn. Alright, there we go. Let's go face John L again. He should give half of our points back, which should put us over at 25. We'll spend the points we have. Should have done this before. I mean, if he's running wood, we should run more metal for defense, but this is why we're so vulnerable to him. Uh, let's see, what would actually increase our spear damage? Earth, uh, water. Again? Instantly? Turn it back on? Oh. Didn't get out of that. Liu Bei taking the blunt of the hit. Oh, 
Hold on, punish. No, we missed it. I wanted to heal. It's okay, we got the timing down. Shouldn't be too difficult to get him back again. He's gonna summon again. Oh, I can't block that, that's not blockable. Or at least, maybe, maybe it is, but I'd rather dodge it. It's doing too much damage to us. Nobody's gonna go down. I'm gonna give him an out here. Can't, can't catch up to him. Maybe this? Yeah, I'm dodging that one. That one I'm not even going to go for, the block or the parry. Okay, we can get the punish here, I think. Finally. He's going to die. Let me heal, make sure I'm good. As he summons, we'll take him out. Oh, save Zhang Fei.习武所谓何事？在下潜心习武，与辟邪共赴战场。终于，在吕将军处寻得答案。习武非为伤人性命，而为守护自身信念。真正的武将，乃为守护信念而战之人。吕将军之坚强信念。收其武器阁下竟愿出手相助看来此人杀之可惜敌将张辽你可愿弃暗投明效力朝廷张辽败军之将All right, we got B. Xie from Zhang Liao. They're changing the story a little bit here. Zhang Liao surrenders at Xiaopei here. 
and is not part of Li Bu's force at Xiapi, which is fine because he was not at Xiapi. As I mentioned, he was a chancellor away from Xiapi. He was ruling, he was helping Li Bu take care of parts of the Sui province, huge place. So he assigned him as a chancellor or administrator, essentially for princedom instead of for a commandery. Same idea, a regional administrator, essentially. And he was marching his force to Sapi to reinforce the siege to help Lu Bu out. But by the time he got there, it was already over. Lu Bu was already executed by Cao Cao. And at that point, Zhang Dao decided to surrender and became an officer for Cao Cao. One of probably the best officers Cao Cao got, uh, given his contributions throughout history, not only in the defense of Hefei in the future, but even in the attack on the north. His decisive charge at the Battle of Bailong uh, against the Wuhan forces basically won Cao Cao the fight against Yuan Xi's remnants, even though it was very risky at the time. But um, the result speaks for itself. Pick up some Taishan gear. And let's see where we're headed. Jin Gong! Give me Ling Xia Pi Chen Ru Shui Di! Shi! All right, the Battle of Sapi, 198. So, this is where Liu Bu dies historically. We get honed in for this one. Uh, we'll come back and fight this, but of course, what we will do. Well, I'll speak to Guo Jia first. Quifutuishiputuishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishish